All right, so now that you know the basics of top rope, I'm just gonna explain a little bit about what lead climbing is. I'm probably sure you might be seeing into the gym already. Lead climbing is where you have a climber and a belayer, just the same, but now the only difference is, instead of the rope already being at the top, which is a top rope, John's gonna be clipping his rope in about every five feet or so into one of those carabiners. As a lead belayer, the difference is I'm not gonna be taking in the rope, I'm gonna actually be giving it to him as he's clipping it in. This is a technique used to climb big walls outside, for example, like in Yosemite Valley or other places like that. Now that you see how lead climbing works, if you're interested to make the transition from top roping to actually to start lead climbing, all you have to do is be top roped, so you're tied into a top rope and you have a belayer on this rope, and then you're gonna tie a second rope to you. This is the rope that you're gonna use to practice clipping into the carabiners as you go up the wall. So when you approach the wall, and there's a quick draw, this is basically a quick draw is two carabiners connecting by a piece of webbing. There's gonna be quick draws already hanging on the wall. To properly clip in, all you're gonna do as you're climbing up, you're gonna stop, grab your rope. So if I'm clipping with my right hand and the gate is facing to the left, I'm gonna use my middle finger to stabilize in the middle of the quick draw and I rotate the rope in. And that's how you clip in. Now the important thing to remember is when you clip, if you kind of laid the wall flat, the rope to your belayer should always be on the closest to the wall, and the rope to you, the climber, should always be on the top of the draw. That's the proper way to clip. If I was going to clip on the other side, so now the gate's facing the right, and I'm using my right hand to clip, you're going to pull the rope up, you're just going to kind of hold it in your hand, because now you're going to squeeze the rope in. So if you notice, the draw is kind of wide at the bottom, so it means you grab up top, and just slowly squeeze in as you come down that's gonna clip the rope right in. Again, making sure that the rope to you is closest to you, the rope to the belayer is touching the wall. Great, so now you know the basics of rock climbing. But before you get out there, make sure you go to your local gym to receive hands-on professional instruction.